Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Who's following me now for a little longer time already knows that the main content on this channel is based on creepypasta stories. So I decided to go for a test today which is telling me if I'm a creepypasta which one would I be. The first question, do you constantly smile? Yes, I grin, not smile. I grin from ear to ear, literally. Yes, but with a hint of evil. No, I have no face. Okay. Uh, who needs to smile when you have large teeth? It's more of a smirk. No, I frown. Oh, that's basically not that easy because I'm not that good in considering how much I smile. I would prefer if I smile but with a hint of evil. The next question. Are you stretchable? <laughs> yes. No, but I am flexible. Who needs to stretch when you have large claws? I would say no, but I'm pretty much flexible. The next question. Are you a killer? Wh what is with that question? Yes. Now go to sleep. I drive people to suicide, no spread the word. Yes, I eat the ones I kill. <laughs> Sometimes. Not really, though I have driven people to suicide. Only to Pokemon. When I want to be. Um, but if we are just in a parallel universe and I would decide what I think or what I consider to be the coolest option here, I drive people to suicide. I guess this is an amazing power. Um, just don't ask me. I, I like creepypasta, okay? That's my excuse. The next question is, who's your best friend? Smile Dog? Jeff the Killer? I have no friends. <laughs> friends? I need no friends. I had a friend once, my master. Friends? I need no friends. I think it's it's cool, it's kind of cool. Again, if we are in this parallel universe and I could decide to go for the badass image I always want to have, uh, then it would be this answer. Do you like the dark? Yes, perfect for killing sleeping people. Yes, it hides me so I may scare my victims. Yes, it hides me so I can catch food. I like this one. <laughs> yes, because I can blend in with it. Sometimes. <laughs> scare my victims. Yes, it hides me so I may scare my victims. It's always so funny if it's already a little bit dark and people are seeing me on the street and they're not used to the alternative style. Their reaction on their faces, it's always, it's brilliant. Are you an, an, an animal? Wow. That's literally a question I was never asked before. Uh, yes, I am a mammal. Yes, I am an experient. Yes, I am a Pokemon. No, I am a human. Well, there had to stand. Yes. Yes, I am a grumpy cat. Well, I would love to be a grumpy cat, but basically I go for human. Next question. Are you usually covered up in blood? Well, I'd say yes. <laughs> I, I like creepypasta, okay? That's my excuse. And the last question. Sad. I like this one, actually. If you had to kill someone, how would you do it? Shh. Go to sleep. I get you. Eat them alive. Hunt them down in the night. As they are sleeping, cut them in half quickly. Stalk and kidnap them. Take them to jungle. Kill them with my hands. That's the fun. It must be a surprise death for them, or maybe even you. Slowly electrocute all of their body parts, then burn them alive. Oh, bad one. You will find out tonight. Have a nice sleep. A night while they are sleeping, secretly go and sit by their side with a creepy smile. Wake them up and slash. Oh, there are nice options in here. I, I like creepypasta, okay? That's my excuse. Well, I would say that's the fun. It must be a surprise. So It must be a surprise. Come on. Alright, we have here the results and I'm totally excited because, you know, I have no clue what kind of character is fitting to what kind of answer. So, let's see. You got Ben Drawn. Oh, I actually didn't think that. You are Ben Drawn, often called Ben. You reside in a haunted Majora's Mask game, Kedridge. You are said to follow the player and cause bizarre glitches in the game. People are terrified of you due to the strange things that happened. Your saying is, you shouldn't have done that. Okay, it's sad because it would be cooler if you get more exploitation to your results, so 
which character traits you, you share or you might share with a character. But actually, I pretty much like the questions and I pretty much like the possibilities of answering. Um, and if you want to do the quiz as well, I will put the link in the description, so check it out. So, this was everything. Uh, I hope you liked and enjoyed it a little bit. Uh, feel free to write me your result in the comment section because I'm always curious. I have the feeling that 2020 will be an awesome year for all of us. I hope we will see us very soon. Have a nice day left. Please stay safe and be kind to yourself. Bye.